Uh, because the president did weigh in on the speaker um, chaos this morning, whether the White House has sort of thought through the implications of there not effectively being a House of Representatives right now and there being no actually actual members of Congress to carry out legislative functions and we for an indefinite amount of time. So you heard the president. He did, as you know, a, a, a gaggle on his way out on the South Lawn, heading into uh, mer heading onto uh, Marine One. He spoke to it pretty extensively. I'm not gonna. I don't have much to add on what he laid out, on what his thoughts were about what currently is happening. Look, what we can say right now is what I've been saying is, uh, you know. We're, we're gonna let the process uh, uh, play out. This is a Republican conference to figure out who they want to be uh, the speaker. Uh, what the president has said and will continue to say, he is he is uh, you know ready to reach across the aisle as, as he's done as senator, as he has said during his campaign, as we've seen him do. We're going, to, we're about to land in Kentucky to talk about a bipartisan uh, uh, piece of legislation, a historic piece of legislation that works on infrastructure. We're gonna have Mitch McConnell on the ground and, and other, and, and other Republicans and we're gonna see that bipartisan we're gonna see how when we work together and this is a little bit about what uh, Mayor Landry was saying when we work together we can do bold transformative things that really help the American people so that's gonna be his focus uh, again I'm just not gonna embellish or go beyond what the president said today at, on the South Lawn. Beyond, beyond the 